Even today, we got an unboxing video from Japan. <laughs> uh, this package, I did DHL uh, because it wasn't too much different than what EMS would have been originally. So uh, it being a smaller package, I was like, yeah, why not? Showed up pretty freaking quick, I might say. Um, <clears throat> as you guys can see here, we got some fancy cards. Thank you for your continued support. Sadly, it was right at the top. So when I caught it with the knife, I nicked the card a little bit. So I'm a little sad about that. Uh, another car with some anime girls on it. Bunch of stuff I can't understand. Uh, this one, pretty excited for it. Uh, the, a lot of this stuff has been kind of sitting in, like, AmiAmi doesn't technically have a pile loop, but because of COVID, uh, they do, uh, you got time to pay for the orders because they they've been extending a lot of the stuff and storing it for you. Uh, in the hopes that EMS and shipping would go back to normal here in the near future, hasn't yet, sadly. Uh, I actually have a few more packages I got to decide what I'm going to do with here in the near future. Uh, but these ones, definitely wanted to get here because... As you can see, we got some Gridman Kaiju goodness. Uh, looks like I'm thinking about actually reviewing this guy since it's a, like Kaiju figures are coming few and far between, <laughs> especially with uh, the NECA announcement. So definitely want to go over this guy. Uh, I'm trying to remember his name. It begins with a D. Also really love the the topper here. We got Akane. She actually this is sculpt him on the top of the package here. Which is really cool. Same way you get the art on the front with the kaiju and the gridman. Also got the giant uh, Figma <laughs> gridman on order too. Um, forget the official name of what they're going by for that one. Uh, but he'll be on his way. Oh, I'm not going to say soon. There's some other guys I got to try to ship here. <laughs> uh, specifically a, re a giant Ryoko from Tenchi Buyo. Uh, that one I've been super excited about, but um, I think shipping on her is like 70 right now. So she's going to be like 260-ish, 270-ish to get her here. Uh, so that's a little bit of a bummer. And then a couple of smaller figures, uh, which those guys are probably a lot together too, because it seems like at least getting a few of these guys doesn't kind of kill the shipping. And then also have the Mandalorian figure from Message Figure Arts. Uh, pretty much been pre-ordering all of these guys. I think the only one I don't have currently on order is the IG. Um, I probably should rectify that now that I think about that. <laughs> so, might, might be adding that one soon. Um, package, sort of similar to what we've seen with some of the other figure arts we've done on the channel. The, like, it's definitely akin to the Boba Fett, but I do like the gold coloring on it. You even get the Mandalorian logo here. But the rest of the package is kind of black. Get some gold trimming on the side. On the back, just has them in some poses. So, I think that's pretty much it. I think it was just the two guys in this one. Yep. So, just to give you guys a little bit of a better look on this guy. Again, I'm going to keep him in the baggie until we do the actual review. Oh, he's got like a translucent dome on the top. Oh, that's kind of sweet. <laughs> oh, you can see his eyeballs. Oh, I'm actually pretty pumped for this. Uh, he actually, he doesn't look that bad. Like, he's got the, a giant seam line on the center. Uh, but it articulates, so that's cool. Looks like his arms can articulate. He's got some tail articulation. Uh, nothing at the legs. Because essentially what these guys are is pretty much just like a Bandai vinyl, in a sense. Uh, but definitely have a lot more details going on than what you usually get with a standard Bandai Vinyl, which is fantastic. I kind of wish they would do more Kaijus like this, or even from other series. Would be awesome. Because I'd definitely be way more on board to buying these and say, um, a certain US company is starting to do stuff. <laughs> Anyways, at least collectible-wise. Because, uh, like again, for kids, I wouldn't, I wouldn't be buying this for them, for the most part. Uh, but pretty sweet. Mandalorian, on the other hand, we're going to open the crap out of this guy. Cause this one, I don't know if it's going to get a full fledged review. I guess it's kind of I knock things over. All depends on if the unboxing video does okie dokies. Also know this guy's been out for a little bit. He's, he's again, he's been one of those, like they were, Hey, you need to pay for your thing. Otherwise we're canceling your order soon. I'm like, okay. <laughs> so combined a few things to get him out of there. But, Get Mando out of his prison. Oh, it's a cloth cape. 
I don't know why I thought it was hard. <laughs> it kind of looked like it was hard plastic initially. Uh, not too shabby looking though. Like, there isn't really too much going on with it. I wish they would maybe make the bottom look a little bit more frilled. Because that is very clean looking. Uh, same with the top here too. That just kind of hangs out on the back. That's a little weird. You'd think that would peg in, but I don't see anything that that would really work with. I'm assuming... You know, we'll just dump these on the table. For the gun here is why that's probably the way it is. Although, I don't notice anything on this either. I kind of show like a peg hole or something for that to click into. Because we got... Oh, that might be... Oh, okay, so that looks like that's the scope. Maybe? Oh, so does this come apart? Is that how that works? And okay, so that comes apart. Cool. <laughs> so, it kind of looks like something fancy. Uh, he's also got a holster here. Uh oh. Mm. Okay, so you can have it with the holster on. That's a lot of glue right there. A little unsightly. Um, but, it's already kind of popping off the figure to begin with. How did, God, stupid tiny bags, nobody likes you. Okay, I'm sorry, everyone likes you, please get in the hole. <laughs> Alright, so, you have a setup like this, get a little bit of articulation with it. Uh, it also comes with this one, if you want them actually holding on to the weapon. Uh, you can have it sitting out. I don't understand why it doesn't have the strap on it, though. That's a little weird. There's also this peg here. I don't know what... This... <laughs> this is the strangest Build-A-Figure <laughs> I've ever bought. Uh, Alright, so that's the regular one. This is the one that appears to hook into his back. So... Pop that in there. The barrel goes on like that. Like so. Follow the piping. And then this goes through the slot in the back. Maybe not. I'm so confused. <laughs> Also, it has not attached. Interesting, interesting. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. Maybe we should do a review of this. There's a lot of stuff going on with this guy that I'm not quite certain how to feel at the moment. That looks like... that. Pro okay, so probably what it does is it pegs into here. And then you have this going through the back of the ting. I probably gotta go the other way though. You know, I wasn't expecting this to be that long of a video, but we're here now. I feel like this shouldn't be as complicated as this is, that this is currently being. Okay, so, all right, so maybe you break it apart and then put that through. You know, it'd probably be simpler just to actually look at the instructions because it would probably tell me <laughs> how this is supposed to work and we won't have to fiddle through this as much. But I like a challenge. Also, we got to get the head back on. Oh, crap. Things are popping off again. Right, I think Mando's head's back on. Hey. <laughs> thought it was back on. I'm going to break this thing before I even get it off the table. Come on! <laughs> Is it not supposed to attach? It feels like it's not supposed to attach. There's a joint there. Pretty certain. Okay, I think I got it on. His head, I'm afraid to move it, but it's at least secure. Uh, we also got his pistol. It'll ever focus. 
looks pretty nice also comes with a lot of hand accessories so that's cool um yeah i'm not quite certain how to feel about this one yet uh random kaiju the I decided to sit on the floor pretty happy with this guy overall the mendo i'm not a hundred percent sold on at the moment like he looks good like detail wise like the armory looks really nice i like the color variety helmet super shiny gun like everything looks nice but the way that uh he's kind of put together is uh a little bit frustrating to say the least i'm actually gonna try to pop out the instructions real quick so okay so if i don't want the strap that's what this little thing's for gotcha oh you can interchange okay so i, I guess that makes more sense i wish they would have just gave us an extra one because it's tiny and things can break um but i guess i get it so what do you do with the back portion is that supposed to hook on it goes underneath the barrel okay wait so where the cuts at that's supposed to line up with the peg on the bottom i don't believe you but all right we'll try that for the sake of science in case people were thinking about getting this the head popped off <laughs> Okay, I guess it does. It just didn't feel like it did, but I guess like me yanking on the back of the head a bit, I guess that kind of does a thing. It's just a lot of finessing because this also really doesn't like the sit in its hole. God, I don't like you. Try not to swear. <laughs> Tried so hard not to swear. All right, that's it. Head. Please, for the love of, stop shifting. Shift it back up. F All right, cool, Mandalorian's a figure. <laughs> right. He's cool, by the kaiju, he's, he's pretty sweet. I'll do a review of him in the near future. <sighs> Maybe this too. Let me know in the comment section. Help us defeat those characters by hitting that like button, subscribe, and comment range your name. We also got an Instagram page on Pinterest, Facebook. Guys, like, keep up the data channel and donate. Greatly appreciate it. Um, check out Ami Ami. They're a pretty cool shop as well. See you guys in the next video. Bye bye.